Being good looking is important for like my social media because obviously I want to attract audience. I'm not going to necessarily get that if I look ugly. My mum, she was a bit funny when I first started getting fillers. This is the first time I've seen her since my eye surgery. I'm a little bit anxious about what he'll look like. What do you think? Mm. I'm definitely going to get to Norwich and realise I've packed <laughs> complete shit that I don't want to. When I look back on pictures of me before I had any surgery, I look completely different. I feel like I've improved myself. I'm Levi Jen Murphy, I'm a social media influencer and I make videos online like Facebook. Yikes! Follow my Instagram. I've literally had a large following since I was like 15. Literally what my news feed is right now. FIFA, FIFA, iPhone 6 pens. Mum, what are you doing in my room? The first time I thought about altering my appearance, it was probably when I was like 16, when I was 18. Obviously I was of age to get like fillers and stuff. That's when I started getting a lip filler and then yeah, it kind of went from there. I have had my lips done. I've had my cheeks done, jaw, chin, and my eyes. And then I started with like surgery. So I got my nose done. I got a lip lift. I got a second lip lift. A temple brow lift. I probably spent 20,000 on surgeries and like fillers and teeth done. I decided to get the surgery because like I just have a lot of insecurities at the time. I've always been paranoid that I've got a big nose. Plus I had the money. I might as well just change it. Who's the real winner here? Social media has had a massive impact on how people think about their appearance, etc. Ayo, nose job check. A lot of you keep calling me plastic. And you may be right. However, I just done a quick Google search. And plastic can live up to a thousand years, so... When I like upload a picture and I start getting likes, if it doesn't get a certain amount of likes in a certain amount of time, then I delete it straight away. Instagram had a filter that made your face like plastic surgery. And it did lift up your eyes and like your lips. Also, you get a nice selection of me with my boyfriend. When I first met Levi, he had already had lip filler injections. His surgery procedures, however, were quite a new thing. So I was a little bit wary, thinking that he obviously could ruin his face. There was obviously like medical risk as well, like that he could permanently damage himself. My latest surgery, I've had mixed reactions. There's like very horrible comments that at the time I'd be like, that's deep. I see like the comments under his pictures, a lot of them are just like purposely negative and like some of them border on like quite hateful. It takes like a lot of like willpower for me not to like reply to them. So I thought I'd read it out some of my Instagram comments. You look like Ruby Rose, but not in a flattering way. I really don't listen to bad comments necessarily because I'm kind of used to it. My mum, yeah, she was a bit funny when I first started getting fillers. She did not want me to get my eyes done. She was kind of like, oh, do you really need that? You should probably stop. So I'm going to Norwich to see my mum and to get my fillers topped up. I'm sure, you know, she's going to be kind of mad.
So I'm now in Norwich. I'm about to get my fillers. Um, and then I'm meeting my mum afterwards and see her reaction. So the filler treatment that I've just had went really well. I've got the dramatic look that I wanted. So that's all good. I'm a little bit anxious about what he'll look like. I wasn't happy because I didn't want him touching his eyes because to me they were perfect. Good, I'm good. So you've had it all done then? Yeah, I've good. had the eye lift, the temple lift and the lip lift. Got it all done. How are you feeling? I feel good. The recovery was kind of intense, but mm. I think I look beautiful. What do you think? Well, I didn't want you having them done, did I? But they're, they're all right, I suppose. I prefer them not being done, to be fair. Mm. Well, yeah, you certainly do look different from when you was a child, that's yeah. for sure. People change. <laughs> when you was a child, I didn't think for one minute you'd grow up wanting all this surgery and fillers and stuff. The surgery Levi's had to change his eyes, I was not happy with at all. And I still think he's mad for having it done, basically. That would look cute. Mm. I don't really like it. I didn't really want him to have it done, so... Yeah, but as your mum, that just is upsetting for me. Well, you should be used to it now. <laughs> He's got his own mind and he'll do what he wants. But I'd rather he didn't. <laughs> so, what else is on your list then? Cheek fat pads removed, which is where they remove the fat pads in your cheek to make it more, like, chiselled. You will look like a doll in the end. Hopefully. That's cute. Not really. <laughs> I wouldn't be mad if I looked like a doll. Well, the fillers are lovely, I'll just say that. <laughs> my appearance is important to me because I just do want to look my best. I just want to be happy with myself rather than look at myself and pick out all insecurities. I do worry about where it'll all end, yes. I wouldn't necessarily say I was striving for perfection. I don't know what I'm really going for. 